Okay, uh, hope y'all can hear me over all this racket. Um, thought I'd show off my new, uh, blacksmith forge that I got set up, um, yesterday, day before, whenever it was. Haven't had a chance to play around with it until today, because today, for once, it's actually, like, kind of stopped raining. Um, anyway, let me give you the tour, and then we'll open it up and see how it's doing. Um, as you can see, the main body is actually a toaster oven. Uh, it was one that my brother had that uh, just quit working on him for whatever reason. I never actually asked the details. Um, I was just hauling trash out of his place and uh, found that toaster oven. So figured it'd be a good, you know, base for a forge. I mean, the walls might be a little bit thin, so it's, I figured it might not hold heat. But um, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Uh, pulled all the guts out. Obviously, didn't want you know melting plastic or anything like that. But um, the fact that there's a bunch of grease caked on the inside is actually working out pretty well because you can actually kind of see the glowing embers, but it's filtered a little bit like it would be with welding goggles. So that's pretty cool. So um, I've got some inch and a quarter for the most part and then a little bit of one inch uh, black iron pipe that I'm using. Um, and then uh, for the air supply, I've got a, <coughs> excuse me, a heat gun, uh, just a cheap one from Lowe's. Um, Heat gun pumps hot air in through here, and then the air goes up into the forge. That uh, gives it an air supply and ideally keeps the temperature up as well. Um, and then below it, we've got this little cap here. I uh, can remove that if we need to clean the ashes out. So, all right, let's um, open her up and see how we're doing. Ah, shit, yeah. A railroad spike is red hot, man. That's awesome. <laughs> okay, cool. I'm going to shut this down and uh, see what I can actually... Actually, you know what? I'm going to see if I can just pull it out while, uh, while I'm video and see. Need to clench it up just a little bit. Nope. Swings a little more. I know this is riveting cinema right here. Ah, yeah, look at that. I got a beautiful red glow in the middle. And, uh, still not quite there on the end, but um, honestly, I'm just going to try hammering it because I don't really know what I'm doing. But I'm just going to try and hammer it out, see how much I get. But I'm going to put it back in there for a few minutes because. If I'm going to do that, then I want to do it straight out of the fire, so. Alright. Thanks for stopping by, guys.